It's full because we've got nowhere to put people. How many have we got to see now? Oh, God, we're up to his eyeballs here. 101. 101. Oh. It's the start of a busy shift for advanced nurse practitioner Chantal. There's over 100 patients in the waiting room, but emergencies are taking priority. And another blue light is on its way. They've rushed in 83-year-old Melvin, who paramedics think could have a life-threatening infection. Advanced clinical practitioner Chantel heads to see him. Melvin, my love. My name's Chantel. I'm one of A&E clinicians, OK? I'm yeah. coming to see you. I'm just going to hear your story first. Right. All right. During handover, things don't quite make sense with Melvin. Um, what's really important to do in resource is just to start from top and work your way down in a methodical order. Yeah. So I need to get a cannula in you so we can give you some medication. Are you allergic to anything? No. Good stuff. Melvin has low blood pressure and a high heart rate. These symptoms can be signs of sepsis. Sepsis is an overwhelming and life-threatening response to an infection. Um, it can result in tissue damage, organ failure and even death. Melvin, can I examine you? Is that all right? Ooh, Good stuff. Let me just close these curtains. I don't want you on show to everyone, do I? Right, Melvin. Nice big breath. Right, you can sit back now, my love. OK. So, Melvin, it looks like you've got an infection. We are. I don't know. I don't know yet. <laughs> I think it might be a urine. OK. Yeah. But your chest's a bit crackly down here, so we're going to get you a chest X-ray as well. Oh. All right. Do you want a glass of water? Yeah. OK, that's fine. Right, let me get on with them, OK? Them little yeah. jobs. Yeah, All yeah. right, I'll be around. OK, hello. Would you send sepsis bloods for me, my love? Yeah. And I'll order this X-ray. OK. Melvin's showing signs of sepsis. So um, <laughs> the root of his sepsis is a little bit unknown at the minute. It could be chest, could be urine. He's not been drinking much. He's quite dry. Sepsis is life-threatening. It's down to the team to find out the source of Melvin's infection. This is Melvin's chest X-ray. Um, it looks like he's got some, maybe a bit of consolidation to his middle lobe on his right lung, otherwise it looks OK. He's got a bit of a cough, so he's on the correct antibiotics anyway. Right, Melvin, tell yeah. me what's happened this morning. I had an appointment at 20 past eight. Yeah. I went to bed. Yeah. And I'm saying to myself all the time, it's 20 past eight. Yeah. But it weren't. It were like one o'clock. So you were getting a bit confused overnight with the yeah, time? Yeah, OK. Yeah. Melvin's condition, coupled with his moments of confusion, convinced Chantel that more investigation is needed. But you're staying in hospital, I'm afraid. I'm staying in. Yeah, so we can look after you. Mm. OK. Where am I staying in? You're, you're going upstairs to the acute medical unit. Is that too dark? Oh, it's OK. That's OK. That's a bit better, isn't it? Yeah. Right, okie doke. Whilst there, an abscess on his liver was discovered, which was successfully treated with antibiotics. 